Hit the sub, like, and bell button. That's right, we're making this our intro now. Hey guys, Devontae for Hollywood Life with your Car Jenner update. But before we begin, Altered Carbon Season 2 was trash and Sonic was actually pretty good. I said what I said. Now let's start with Sophia Richie because her relationship with Scott Disick is going so well, he's beginning to post me Happy Meals to her private jet. You see? stars are just like us. From serving Mickey D's to serving trolls, in Kourtney Kardashian's latest selfie on Instagram, she captioned it, game over man, game over. And while her sister was confused with the caption, a fan doubled down adding a ton of shade and said, good, does that mean she's off the show? Because her attitude is so negative and mean to her sisters, I think it will be better. She is so unappreciative of everything the show gave her and Scott. They had a condo she shared with Chloe. It's a long way from there to her house she owns now. Court kept her response short and said, keep analyzing. This reply works both as a clapback and a request indicating the fan might be onto something and she's willing to take her up on the free psychoanalysis. I also said a bunch of unnecessary mumbo jumbo there because this isn't real news. Anyway, to Kendall Jenner because we have her reaction to Kris Jenner saying the model might be the next family member to get pregnant. We're hearing exclusively Kendall knows that Kris was totally joking and the thought of her having a child is nowhere on her radar. We're also hearing Chris deep down does think Kylie will be the next family member to have a child, but it might not be anytime soon. Well, that too was brief, but it doesn't matter because now we get to discuss Kylie who gave fans a lot to talk about over the weekend. First off, the lip kit mogul went from changing her hair color to changing her hair length, like really changing the length. Fans were quick to make jokes calling her Rapunzel, confusing the braid for a snake, and Chloe even chimed in saying, don't ever call me extra again. Hard to argue with Chloe on this one, but I'm just curious to see if she tried to jump rope with it or wear it as a belt. Like, does anyone with this amount of hair try that? But all right, to Kylie's love life now because she may have confirmed her romance with Travis Scott is officially back on. Kylie posted some old PDA photos of her and LaFlame from a 2017 Houston Rockets game captioned, It's a Mood. On top of this, Kylie took a series of pictures modeling Travis's new SB Dunks, which retail at $150. Now the unreleased sneakers are being priced at around one grand. Kylie and Travis were also spotted with their daughter Stormy over the weekend riding around Calabasas after having lunch. We'll keep you updated on all the latest, but for now, hit that sub, like, and bell button, and let me know the quickest way to get to Union Square from Bushwick in the comments below.